it is the UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world between AJ, Anthony Joshua, and the Gypsy King, Tyson Fury. Well, for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. Well, a lot of people think it's the most significant title in combat sports. No argument from me. Baddest man on the planet, UFC heavyweight champion. There he is in the flesh. What an absolute monster. What a title reign it has been. But a serious challenge in front of him here tonight. When this man became the heavyweight champion, a lot of people thought that this challenger was the one who would wrest the belt away. Now the fight is here. We'll see if we get a new champion or if this man continues one of the greatest heavyweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So these fighters are just a year apart with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now for the particulars, he is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet, nine inches tall, weighing in at 257 pounds. Presenting the challenger, Tyson Fury. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet, seven inches tall, weighing in at 237 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending USC heavyweight champion of the world, Anthony Joshua. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it Strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. Tonight. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight they get someone that allows them to fight in their comfort zone. They don't have to worry about defending takedowns. All they have to worry about is who can rely on their knowledge in the striking to carry them to victory. Big punch land over the top. How's he going to follow this one? He's hurt bad. Oh, straight right. Oh, what a fantastic strike to go 
throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, he might be out. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Oh, straight right. Trying to establish that jab once again. Joshua's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there and closed quickly. Oh, nice punch there by Fury. How about that shin? Just misses there with the left. And he landed the right hand there. Fury gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Guard. We have now hit the final minute of this championship fight. Just misses with the left hook. Nice punch, man, over the top. And both guys really throwing with authority. A good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. All right, so he leads with the right hand there, and it was effective for him. Most times he's behind the jab, but sometimes you gotta just mix it up. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. Misses with the Jets. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit for it. Whoa! He's out! That was nasty! What a fight! He knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us on for this contest. At one minute, 31 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by... Hey!